So I have six identically scrambled Rubik's Cubes. They are the same. The scramble I used is up on the screen. It's a randomly generated scramble. And I'm going to solve these today with a different starting color for each one. Now it may be easier than it looks, but I only start with white, so it's going to be a lot harder than I think it's going to be. A couple of the colors like blue, it looks like, will be an easier starting color. Green possibly will be easier, but F2L will be hard no matter what because I'm used to white. So we're just going to start, we're going to solve white first and get inspection time. Okay, that was a pretty bad solve there. Uh, it, it's partly the cube, partly me, but uh, that's 37 seconds, 37 and a half seconds for that solve. And this is not a magnetic cube. It's not my main, so that's a part of the reason why. But let's see how the other colors compare with that time. I'm gonna solve yellow first on this cube. Starting with the yellow, this should be, I would guess, around the similar time because it's not all that different from white. But start with inspection time. I'm sure I can improve a lot on my inspection. The yellow's <laughs> hard. So that one was 42.8 seconds with solving yellow. But not terrible. I just couldn't find my pieces because I'm used to solving white first and all the whites were getting in my way. So for this one, I think we'll solve red first. And let's just see how it works. These are pretty nice turning cubes, but they're not like... Uh, like my magnetic main, even though my magnets aren't super strong. Let's just see here. Okay, I kind of like that. And here's where it gets hard. Found my first pair. Here's my second pair. This should not be taking this long. Put it in all okay, just looking for the last pair here. Moving like that's it there. It was sitting there right in front of me, and I couldn't find it. Okay. Okay, still under a minute, 55 seconds. Well, that's good. That was red first. And I had a lot of 
blank time because I just couldn't find the pieces I was looking for. I need to start looking for pieces, specific pieces, instead of just looking for stuff that look like they go together. This one I'll solve blue first, and it kind of looks like it could be good. Where's my other blue? There. Okay. the cross. Okay, I'm looking for a red and yellow. Oh, it's right next to it. It's tough. How about a yellow and orange right there? put in the white corner as the last pair. There it is. Okay, that's a minute 16 on, on blue. Yeah, I, I was, I'm still getting lost. I need to work on color neutrality for sure. So this one, orange is going first. And let's just see how this one goes. Okay. And this is gonna be bad. I didn't even find all my cross pieces. Orange. orange corners. Plus two if I was in competition. So technically a 45.8 if I'm doing a plus two. <laughs> so orange went a little better than blue. And let's see how green goes. So orange is almost second best. Yellow is second best. But let's try for green. Let's see how green goes. too bad. And I'm looking for a white and green. I know there's one around here. I'm green corner. I'm a green corner. Which means I need a white and orange. Which is there. Okay, one, uh, 110. So I think we can agree that uh, blue and green are my worst colors for sure. 
and now for the fun of it, I brought in my main, same scramble, and we're gonna see how well I do for the same scramble, but with magnetic cue. better. I feel like I made that same mistake. Okay, I did a little bit better. I think I found close to the same solution for that one as uh, my first solve, which makes sense, I guess. So that is solving three different, uh, solving starting on a different color. And you can tell by far white is my best. I think yellow was next, then orange, red, green, blue, if I remembered correctly. and. It does make a little bit of a difference having the magnetic cube, so I'm happy with that, and, and that's that.